Want to make incredible jaw-dropping artwork that you can show off using only colored pencils? You're watching Draw With Me BA Art and today's video is about 5 tips to improve your colored pencil drawings. Tip 1. Block in all of your shadows and darkest colors first. You will notice here that I start with the darkest parts of the drawing first. I even put in a darker red over the shadows in the pepperoni before adding a bright main red. This will help you to get the best contrast in your drawing. Going in with the light colors first can actually make it more difficult to get your darkest values. Starting with the darkest values helps you get the best color out of your color pencils. Tip 2. Don't use black for the shadows. Instead, use a dark brown or a dark blue. If you use black for all of your shadows, it can make the drawing look a little dull or washed out. To avoid this, I like to use a dark brown or a dark blue for the shadows. I use brown for warm toned areas and blue for cool toned areas. To tell if an area is warm toned or cool toned, I look at the area I'm drawing in. If I see more reds, oranges, or yellows, then I will use a brown color for a warm toned area. If I see more blues or purples, I will use a blue for a cool toned area. Because my pizza has mostly reds and yellows, most of my drawing will be warm toned, so I will probably use a brown color for the shadows in the pizza. Tip 3. Work slowly. This video is sped up quite a bit to only 3 minutes, but in reality, this drawing took me probably about 2-3 to three hours. Colored pencils are one of the slowest mediums to work with. There is lots of layering, time, and patience that goes into a colored pencil drawing. Sometimes it's hard to be patient with this medium, but taking your time is so essential. Enjoy the process and relax. Going slow means taking time to layer, pick out colors, and blend. Not only will your drawing turn out better this way, but it's a lot less stressful than rushing through it. Tip 4. Pick the right colors. Picking the right colors can be super hard. Keep a reference photo on hand so you can match your colored pencils with the right colors. It's important to notice all the colors when looking at the reference photo. For each topping, I picked out a highlight color, a main color, and a shadow color. It's also important to note that value matters more than color. Value is how light or dark a color is. If you have a small color pencil set and are worried you won't have the same color as in your reference photo, then a similar color will work just fine, as long as the color is the same value as your reference photo. I made a video talking about my process of picking out the right colors for this drawing. I will link the video down below if you are interested. Tip 5. Blend your colored pencils. There are several different mediums you can use to blend your colored pencils. My personal favorite is to use the solvent. It blends the colored pencils really well, and you can even layer more colored pencils on top after it has dried. I recently made a video where I cut this pizza into slices and try different blending methods on each slice. I will link that video down below as well. I hope that these tips will help you with your colored pencil drawings. Thanks so much for watching, and I will see you in the next video.